back to our number three of role play. We have just slain the bugbears and the party sealed up. Bugbears. Friends, they were called by some sort of a trumpet and they obviously wanted to attack us, so I say that we investigate it. I agree. I, I agree. So did we did we kill all of them, the original number? I didn't yes. get a head count of them. We killed them I all. I did get so a I... head count. <laughs> 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 what I'm thinking is uh, there was no necessarily distress signal like they couldn't have if we killed them all none of them could have escaped and alerted people to set off the alarm so i wonder what that that alarm could be for i imagine some form of a leader or at least reinforcements battle for sure possibly let's go investigate i agree yeah i'm already riding <clears throat> the, the way of the trumpet lisa do you know of these woods so i, I take off by the way <laughs> okay, where you that's what your cleric to... he's just gonna this three foot tall cleric is like <laughs> yeah. I'm gonna head towards the trumpet. Yeah, yeah. We'll all okay. easily catch up to the pony. <laughs> true that's that, true that's that. my thought process actually. <laughs> the leg strides carry him about a foot and a half away from us while we're having this conversation. Anyways. Gregory, no, Lisa doesn't know anything of the woods. She said that these are not the bandits. So let's uh, let's follow our little friend here and make sure he doesn't get himself killed. He's quite useful. Let us ride. <laughs> Let us ride. As we okay. go forward, Neil. So I'm at 32. What's my overall health? Like my capacity? Your max HP is 37. Oh wow! So I'm actually. Is it only 37? What a terrible. It's the second, third highest in the party. <sighs> The second, third highest in the party of four. Yeah, I hear you. That's, uh, not bad, huh? I didn't realize that um, JP had so much life. Yep. But that Does high it? constitution. Yeah, JP I... has 44. That's ridiculous. <laughs> A little three foot man. All right, anyways. And I rolled yeah, so shit we... on my fucking HP, so. <laughs> we just roll, we, we walk forward, Neil, on our horses. Yeah. Just go forward. All right. You guys catch up. Um,. And as you're looking about, oh yeah, uh, fairly soon, as soon as Bregor catches up to you guys, Bregor sees a uh, tracks from where there were clearly a bunch of big players standing. Excellent. I give the the look that says "follow me," boys. Yeah, right. I follow. Do the tracks indicate how many, or are they like sand people? They're like sand people. Okay. Mm. Um, but there's at least three. What is that contraption? I've never seen something like that. T. Yeah, but okay, never mind. <clears throat> anyway. It's probably a fringe producer. It's a battery thing. operated <laughs> personal friend of the romantic type. No, but it like comes through the bottom into the Yeah, I don't know. French it's press for tea, like... dudes. Come on. Never seen that. Okay. Um, <laughs> so, yeah, we keep riding towards the bugbear fort. <laughs> Or where, wherever the tracks are leading. Is that the contraption making that noise? You might be hearing our dryer. Oh, okay. <laughs> I was like, Jesus, what? That fringe press is amazing. <laughs> <laughs> it makes the best tea ever. Yeah. Ignore it. <laughs> <laughs> so this is the noise of the horn, right? Yes. yes. No, this is your horses. They're. Uh, yeah, really anyways, fast. we follow this. <laughs> we go in the direction of the, the feet. Yeah, we are following the tracks of this, the bugbears. Yeah. yeah. You follow the tracks for a ways, and they approach a, a cave that, or a, like a depression in the ground that leads underground. Hmm. I point to the cave, and I say the bugbears are probably in here. Should. Do you guys want to go investigate this? Do you want to go in the cave? Yeah, I do. Do any of us know anything about bugbears, Neil, aside from what we just learned from fighting them? Would I? Aren't they cavernous creatures? Yeah. Um, JP would actually know quite a bit yeah, about they're, them. Yeah, they're actually like fucking sworn enemies of dwarves, right? Or something uh, like that. But they have such an adorable name. Bugbears. Easy. I think you might actually be getting a bonus when you fight bugbears. Do you hate them, Jay Pizzles? I fucking hate them. Well, not necessarily hate them, but you know, let me double check. I don't. I might be making shit up. I do that a lot. 
Dwarves, dwarves, dwarves. Well, this is a game of imagination, so I don't know if we can fault you for making things up. <laughs> it's like, God <laughs> damn it, Neil, stick the, to the plan here. The DM makes things up? Oh, this is I, outrageous. It's... Yeah. Oh, yeah, by the way, it, I... It... Right, go ahead, Neil. In melee, dwarves add plus one to their dice rolls to hit orcs, half-orcs, goblins, and hobgoblins. When oh. ogres, trolls, ogre, magi, giants, or titans attack dwarves, these monsters subtract four from the roll because of the dwarves' small size this and compatibility against much. Match. This is awesome to be a dwarf. It's but hit bugbears hit are box. not on that list. So. Abigail, yeah. do you say that in game? He's a hitbox fighter. <laughs> no, no. <Okay. sighs> All right, so I uh, dismount from my horse, and I'm guessing I look at this, and there's no way we can ride our horses in there. Right? Right. Sure. I say, well, mine I, might fit. <laughs> tie it to a horse, or I tie it to a tree, rather. And uh, I motion to the friends to follow me in. Do uh, you have a source of light? What about it's the very mace? Very quickly. Does what my, about the mace? Does the mace shine? Yeah. Is it doing it's anything? It's not shining currently. Okay. Try saying things, Asriel. <laughs> <laughs> You're the one that got this. Did you, did the... Do I still have a torch? I guess is what I would say. We have torches on did our we, bodies. Did we notice when the mace... Like, was showing light if the the wizard was saying anything? Do or you not remember? At all? I, I mean, Abigail remember whatever would. you remember. Uh, <laughs> um, yes, on. apparently Vincent Longborn has four torches on him. Yeah, so I light one, I guess. And a ring of wishes. <laughs> Just saying. Yeah. I know, Neil. We're on a mission right now, please. I wish it was light in this cave. <laughs> <laughs> Don't say it, Vincent. Puts it on. I wish for my body to give off light all the time. <laughs> and thus borns the glowworm prince. <laughs> nope, nope, nope. Not going near that one. Um, hold on, hold on. Do I still have... Draw upon holy might on me because then I would actually be glowing and there would the cave would be lit if this is true. Like it's one round per level, so it's has it been six rounds? I casted that in like the fourth round of that fight. No, um, okay. it's definitely been you, it glows, yeah. It says the when the spell is cast, the priest's body gods. shudders and glows with a shimmering aura as it becomes a vessel for the power of his god. And in the third hour of the show, the group decided how to light themselves exactly. and go into the cave. Exactly. So, yeah. Lisa suggests dousing Abigail in oil <laughs> and lighting her on fire. I having... suggest killing Lisa. <laughs> oh, god. How does that Cat light fight. the cave, Abigail? God. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we fucking use the torch. That, uh, Maybe Vincent if we has. used all our gems to reflect the lights into the cave. <laughs> we could do that as well. Do you do that? Do you brandish all your gems? You just no, pull no, them no. Right now? no, no, no. All of Lisa's Wait. gems. Oh. Okay. Yeah. Anyways, Neil, let's save some time. I light my torch and walk in. Yeah. Oh, okay. Shield oh. still armed. Damn it. Foiled again. <laughs> you guys God. walk in the, the cave. Um, how many are we counting? Okay. So you enter the cave, and it goes in and kind of down for a little while, uh, and eventually opens into a very large communal room where you see there are thirteen-ish, a little more than a little more than a dozen. Uh, bugbears that are armed and kind of having a discussion and then as you approach and the light uh, lights the cave they all turn and look at you and they seem kind of like wait what the fuck are you doing in my house was sort it pitch of, black kind of, and they're just sitting in the pitch black just yeah well they yeah they, they have they're provision that. They're oh wait we we don't even need jeff was the only one that couldn't see anything the rest of us yeah. could see in the cave perfectly you have yeah. night vision or whatever i do yeah ah. Anyways. Well, anyways, I just wanted to point that out. <laughs> yeah. All right, I walk in, and uh, I say, so I, I actually, as I, as I take the torch and I kind of dig it into the ground, <laughs> I go, well, time to cut up me some bugbears. Some of the bugbears chatter, and one of them, like, points at the party, and they keep talking a bit, and uh, one steps forward with, like, a deep, grumbly voice, goes... 
What? What do you want? Your friends ambushed us on the pathway, friend. They tried to murder us. If we have no quarrel with you, I'd like to... I would uh, definitely take that path, but... Are you going to try to attack us as well? No attack. We... Uh... Yield. Why did you guys attack us? Uh... He starts muttering with one of his friends. And they're... They seem to be having a very heated discussion. Voices get raised. And then the guy turns back and goes, uh, uh, m- money. Money? Money. That doesn't he, seem like, like the truth. Pocket and like, pulls out uh, a coin. That doesn't seem like the truth, Mr. <clears throat> Bear. You should speak the truth. You know we are powerful warriors. Arr. And then I point at Vincent. I'm like, he killed a lot of your friends. He kind of blinks at you a little bit. Well, if you do yield and uh, you give us your bugbear code of honor that you will not attack us, then I I suppose we're on our way, and we're sorry for intruding on your dark cavernous cave lair where you live. Okay. And then I pick up the torch. They they put their hands kind of up in there and go, "Uh and just kind of nod. Who sent you? Who ordered you to attack us? Abigail asks these questions as I start yeah. to make my way out of the cave, and yeah. uh, I walk on. He doesn't say anything? No, he just kind of goes, uh... I turn to Abigail, and I'm like, uh, Abigail, I don't believe they speak very much common tongue. So there's no I point I believe in they do. Uh, I'm like, well... Over his shoulder at one of the guys behind him. It's kind of like a subtle, like a... One of those. I look at the guy and I say, why did you attack us? What do you want from us? Well, what did you want from us? He's just kind of standing there with his arms crossed. Uh, It quickly gets dark, but it's not a big problem since you guys all have infravision. Because Jeff leaves with a torch. Yeah. Yeah. I guess I follow and then I say, why the guy, why won't you guys want to know why they attacked us? I repeat once again, Abigail, I do not believe they speak very much common. I think they do. I also believed him when he said money. He didn't seem to be that convinced. He had to ask his friend, and then they kind of came up with that bullshit argument. A- Abigail, I-, I believe they were asking each other how to say these words. That's why he yeah, held how to up say the, the word. What, what was the word for money? <sighs> That's what I got out of it, too. If Whatever. you wish to start the fight, then feel free. But... I didn't want to f- start a fight. I wanted to know what the hell they wanted us. I do not believe that is in our... Uh... Whatever. In our best Let's interest. Just move forward and ignore wars and bears. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. <laughs> We're going to the. Uh, All right. Let's continue okay. riding towards the. Yeah. The five of you exit the cave, and get back to your horses. Hop back on and continue riding towards the temple at the end of the world. Perfect. Um, the lower rift. All of our horses were still there. Yeah. Gregor's had gone mad though while he tied it up to the tree. And that's that's why I was asking. Yeah, actually. To put it down. yeah. yeah. There's Mine a is actually the chillest of all horses when we get out there. <laughs> Don't make me roll for this. No, it's fine. <laughs> roll Anyways. for it. Chillest horse. No, we're not rolling for it. Gregor is the red die. God damn it. Your horse gives the least amount of shits. Yes. All right. That does not might. Does, right. Yeah. That does not mean he's chill though. Let's ride. Super chill. <laughs> yeah, we head in the direction of the mission. Okay, you guys continue to ride. It's probably it's going to be like a week or so of riding to get there. Okay. Um. So due to the fact we have some wounded, right? Still, like Abigail is only at sixteen or fifteen, right? Right. So, do we have a town to stop at? I suppose is what I'm asking. There's no, no towns on the map. Oh, are we in the woods now? We're heading. Yeah. We're heading towards the temple. Oh, okay. Yeah. Then I guess I recommend we just make camp and rest for a day. I would say. Sure, I can patch up Hi. wounds. And actually, I forgot that we fuck. I, I'm still in pre-cleric mode here, so actually, Neil, we just rest for like a couple days, enough times for him to reset his spells to heal us, I would say, right? And didn't Which... Gregor have spells too? Yeah. No, not yet. No, oh, I, he's got... I have the ones bestowed. Yeah, yeah I gave him cure. I, cure but once light he uses those, else. those are gone, aren't they? Right. Yeah. Yeah, but JP can't memorize spells until he uses them, or memorize new 
they, JP loses the ability to cast those spells when he gives them to Breger. What did I? I gave you. I gave you a light heal, and I forgot what the other one was. I don't remember either. Whatever. Let's just say it was a moderate heal, because I think it's it's what one and one, right, Neil? I'll read the spell. I don't remember. While we're figuring this out, let's just say that I heal everyone for that Draw first day. Draw upon holy sleep. might. They're saying, whatever that means. Oh, okay, okay. There you go. So yeah, that first day when we make camp, I go around healing people up. Neil, do I need to roll okay. for it, or you just want to say? Yep, it? Okay. yep, yep. I just need one. All right, so I've got one light heal, which is a d6, right? Let's see. D8. Roll one D8 on Vincent for two. That didn't do very much. Whatever. Vincent's I'm at 34, at 34 now. Uh, What's your max? He's Actually, three. since we're after this now... You get healed for another two. <laughs> and then... I'm at 18 on 28. Yeah, I'm going to cast one moderate, which is a 1D10. Plus one. Plus one. For three. What is he fucking roll? God damn it. Uh, then that is all I've got. So I'm at 21 out of 28. For the first day. Yeah. And I motion or mentioned to, uh, I asked Bregger how, uh, Quantaris, Quantaris's powers are treating him. Uh, I have not yet used Quantaris's powers. Ah, well, it might, uh, might help, help us, help me out here as, uh, we're trying to get the party up and up to, up to snuff, is what I say. Okay. What is what is everybody's HPs at right now? I'm at 21 out of 28. I don't know about everyone else. Brigger is at 41 out of 49. Vincent's at 36 out of 37. Lisa is at 11 out of 20. I'll heal Lisa. Okay, D8. Plus anything or just... Just a D8. Three. What in the fuck are these heals? <clears throat> So now that spell is gone for me, and JP can learn yes. it now. Or? Okay. Yeah. Yes. All right. So that's all I can do. Uh, okay. I'll have to. Uh... Well, we'll sleep for the night so that he can rest up his spells too, right? Yeah. 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 And I'm going to be well rested, Neil, so I can maybe gain back one health after tonight. Well, you. You need to complete rest. Like you just battled yesterday, so you can't heal until you've had a full day of like non-strenuous activity. Well, that's what this full day is, I think, right? We're just oh, it's like, oh you guys are spending like a full day camping, so that yeah. he can then have his heals for the next oh, oh, okay, okay. Yeah. Yeah, 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 cool. So then you will get a HP from that rest. Yeah. In fact, everyone will get an HP from that rest, which brings me twenty-two. And meanwhile, I'll go 42. ask Trigger about <laughs> that guy. Fifteen. So, Breger. Mm, Abigail. Did you end up stealing that? Hold on, Lisa sky? comes over. Oh, and come asks... on. <laughs> Lisa, I mean, how I don't want to have heal? to do as How was the heal? I don't want to have to do this again. I, I'm teasing, I'm teasing. Go ahead, finish your sentence. <laughs> About that guy I told you to steal money from, did you get it? I decided not to. I figured oh. since it was our, our new dwarven friend's money that I might as well not steal that. Yeah, that's that's true. Do I hear this conversation, Neil? No, I would Probably not have not. did it next to him. And okay. if he yeah. was there, I would have spoken in Elvis. I was only asking because I would have called Breger on his shit right there. No, I waited <laughs> until you leave. I waited until you left to steal it. Yeah. Oh, that's true. Okay. You're Breger's right. the only one that knows, except for the one-armed man. Exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Like, oh, that's too bad. You you shouldn't hesitate to grab that money. I think it's silly that he gave it, but all right, all right. Maybe in the future I will. It's too bad, man. It's too bad. It's too bad, man. <laughs> too bad indeed. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we sleep and rest yeah. for the day. Yeah. Who's uh, uh, before I close my final? I uh, I ask the party. Is someone watching out? The bugbears could attack in the middle of the night. Yes, we'll leave guards. I'll take first watch. Okay. And we go okay. sleep. Yeah, you guys sleep. Uh, uneventful sleeping. Nothing happens. So you got plus one. So I'm at 22. 
Yeah. Cool. Um, and the entire next day passes uneventfully as well. Alright, so I, I'll heal up whoever the next day. Who, who needs it? Vincent needs it, right? No, no I'm um, done. Jen, Breger, and Lisa. How much HP does Jen need? I need... She needs six. Yeah. You're getting five. That's all I'm doing. Perfect. <laughs> How much does Lisa I feel need? Much better. Lisa needs five. Oh. Roll. She gets eight. <laughs> Breger, how much do you need? He needs eight. Seven. He needs seven. You get it. Yes. Okay. Yay. So those cool. are four light heals, just in case something happens during the day. Okay. Um, and then you guys were going to sleep tonight as well, so that you could have full spells, is what I remember you saying. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I, I mentioned to the party, I, I asked... Uh, would you guys like to head out today, or do you want to wait one more day? We can wait if you guys want to. I don't really mind. Sure. All right. So you guys spend the rest of the day. Uh, so that does that night... mean I'm at 28? No, no, because you didn't gain a night from the f oh, HP from the first night of sleeping. You gained it from the second right. night of sleeping. Um, night passes uneventfully again, and you wake up in the morning. <laughs>